the phonetic range that is there in Indian languages is such, it stimulates every aspect of who you are. English language has a very narrow phonetic range. So this ability to use sounds to stimulate and trigger one's intelligence and energy within ourselves is something that we should not give up. Every child must know one more language other than English, whatever that is, because anyway our states are divided on linguistic basis. So in that state, whatever the language is, they must know. We should not kill these languages because it's taken thousands of years to create it. This is our national pride that we have the maximum number of languages. If we had to create this many languages, see, we must understand this. For example, let's say Tamil Nadu and Karnataka, Tamil Nadu and Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu and Kerala. There are no geographical separation. There is no… there are no oceans between these states. There are no mountain ranges clearly demarcating and separating the populations for a long time. But though they lived here for thousands of years, they kept their language, these people kept th their language. <laughs> it's so beautiful. <laughs> when they went to trade and transact, they learned the other language, but they always kept their language. But today, the new generations are losing their language so rapidly, it's very important, all of you, at least in your homes with your children and wherever possible, there must be a certain amount of time where we must use the local language. It's very important. We will regret this deeply after a couple of generations if we don't take care of it now. Because you can't bring back a language, you can kill it, but you can't breathe life into it, it's very difficult.